Good work. I was worried the drive might have been damaged. You can use Chief Show's workstation to download the fabrication plan. Then we can reconstruct your arming key. Morgan, Alex has you boxed in. Look, there's nothing I can do about the lockdown from out here. But I promised I'd help you, so listen. Deep storage was built with a series of data vault modules that can be jettisoned from the station. It's a redundant backup system. That's your way out. Look at my workstation again. I'm exposing a utility that'll open up one of the vaults. Once you're in, look for a manual release. Then your ass is space junk, like me.
microgravity detected. They're afraid. <laughs> Nothing that interferes with memory formation. Morgan? Morgan, this is Chief El Azam. The airlocks on Talos are sealed, but there's a, an opening at the cargo bay you could use. I think you can get back inside the station here. if it might be bothering you that you planned your own death. It's a lot to swallow. My advice would be, try not to think about the end. Focus on what's in front of you, one step at a time. I'm here if you need help. to all contacts in proximity. Please, whoever is out there, listen to me. Oxygen is low and I have no spacesuit. An accident in Cargo Bay forced me to seal myself inside this container, but I have no way to dock with the station from in here. There's not an airlock anymore. That explosion took care of that. Maybe you can do something with the shipping containers.
Jessica. Got a minute? It's my day off. Yeah, but can you run me through the container docking procedure again? I, I missed the training session. Ugh, Grant. Please. If I ask Gus again, he'll lose his mind. Are you at the crate docking control station? Yes. First, enter the handling number on the container you want to dock. Um, where do I get the number? Look, look at the container, Grant. It's stenciled on the outside. Once you enter the number, you should see some options pop up. Select dock. That's it. The container just docks itself, right? Yes, Grant. It docks itself. They are all self-piloting. And I guess open opens the container? Yes. But, well... Oh, at last. I thought that crate would be my coffin. Even the stale air of Talos laced with a faint hint of nicotine and antibacterians. Oh, he's like spring. You are my thanks, Dr. You. But I thought... Well, you're no longer running the memory hamster wheel, I see. I hope you're coming in after me. Would be good to see a familiar face. And transmitting the code to the crate I was in. Found Dr. Igwe. He worked in the simulation lab and in psychotronics. He might be helpful, but he's unlikely to approve of your mission, despite everything he suffered. Though I will note, he's always admired you and Alex quite a bit. Hey, uh, Jessica, got a minute? It's my day off. Yeah. Can you run me through the container docking procedure again? I, I missed the training session. Ugh, Grant. Please. If I ask Gus again, he'll lose his mind. Are you at the crate docking control station? Yes. First, enter the handling number on the container you want to dock. Um, where do I get the number? Look, look at the container, Grant. It's stenciled on the outside. Once you enter the number, you should see some options pop up. Select dock. That's it. The container just docks itself, right? Yes, Grant. It docks itself. They are all self-piloting. And I guess open opens the container? Yes. But both ends can never be open at the same time. That way the interior loading zone stays pressurized even when the cargo bay doors are open. Okay. I think I got it. Thanks, Jess. Jess? Hey, you there? Okay, bye.
Doctor Yu! Morgan! Up here, Officer Cool. If we can't open the main door or our friends are gonna pour through. Get up to the catwalk, we'll get you inside. Doctor Yu, again, I want to thank you for the timely rescue. I hope you recall me. Dr. Igwe, Dio Igwe, your brother, Alex, brought me to the station to head up Neuromod research. I have one, but no aptitude template. We're saving it, but, well, now might be best. Here, I'm sure you could make better use of it. Morgan? I thought... I don't know what I thought. It's good to see you. Is Transtar mounting a rescue operation? I was in fuel storage when... when the fire broke out and everyone began running. But they weren't running from the fire, it was these shapes. I had contained the fire and I was trying to reach the power supply when Al, Officer Rose, came and got me out. I'm glad he did. I didn't know what was going on or anything about those things. Everyone I worked with, they're dead, aren't they? I wonder if one of the creatures caused the explosion in fuel storage. Are they intelligent? Did they plan this? I heard all the escape pods malfunctioned. All of them. How is that possible? How did this all happen? God, watching those things move makes me sick. If he stayed there, he might have survived longer than any. What is it doing? Oh my God, did it? I think I'm gonna be sick. It just made another one of those things, like it, like it pulled it right out of Enoch's corpse. Ugh, corpse? Maybe. I don't know, maybe it saved him. It could still be Enoch. Does it look like it? Sam. Promise me you'll kill me if I ever end up like that. Sarah will get us out of this. She got us this far. We're safe in here. For now, I'm going to check the perimeter. So you came all this way, only to get back into Talos? Only way in is through the door to Cargo Bay B, which is filled with those creatures that your brother insisted couldn't escape confinement. Kind of like you. I'm the only one with the code. It's yours if you can help us secure the firepower we should have had when assigned here. The Eradicator Turret Fabrication Plan. The- Wait. You have the fabrication plan already. That means all we need is a working fabricator. But there was an accident in fuel storage, so power's down. We'd need to get the power back on. I couldn't ask you to risk yourself. The explosion in fuel storage nearly killed Ekaterina. I can't ask anyone to risk themselves. Not even you. Still, look around. Maybe there's some angle you see we don't. You've been... resourceful so far. Look, I don't know what you're planning, Morgan, but just remember. The only thing that matters is how you treat the people that are still alive.
Any luck with those turrets? I don't know if waking uh, well, must be a way to get some toys. Thank you, Al. Might have been safer in this crate. These Transtar PPN-8 pistols are mostly for show. They don't do much against the attackers. With the Eradicator turrets, we have a chance. Dr. Igwe is blessed. It was fortunate you came along when you did. <laughs> 